All right, Dog Positive here, leader of the pack at the Paws Veterinary Clinic. And we're here with Curtis. Mm -hmm. Curtis is a kitty cat. He's about five or six years old. He's a big boy. Curtis has been here since the 14th, and today is the 25th. He came in because he had not been acting well. He hadn't been eating. He was getting lethargic. Uh, throwing up and actually when he came in it was at the end of the day on a Friday and uh, we looked at him and Curtis was fairly depressed I don't mean that in a minute you know he's just not feeling well and uh, dehydrated and he had some ulcerations in his mouth some sores on his tongue and his breath was really really bad and Doc suspected that he was in uh, kidney failure, uh, or not necessarily kidney failure, but he had compromised kidney function. Kidneys are filters. They filter waste products out of the blood. And those waste products then get excreted uh, in urine. And when the kidneys aren't functioning properly, kitty cats get an accumulation of those waste products, toxins in their bloodstream. That suppresses their appetite. It increases their thirst because their body is sending signals that we got these built up of waste products, so we got to drink more and we have to pee more. Because sometimes we tell people they're kitty cats in compromised kidney function. They say, no, he's peeing a lot. That's compromised kidney function uh, until uh, it goes so bad that their kidneys shut down. But he came in. So we did some blood work to evaluate his kidney function. Uh, and we started him on fluids. And the fluids... A person with compromised kidney function, severe, would be on dialysis. Doc was on dialysis five or six years ago. After my gastric bypass, I went into kidney failure, and I was on dialysis for two months in ICU until my kidneys started working again. Knock on wood. No kidney transplant for Doc. But dialysis is not practical in kitty cats. They don't understand it. When I was having dialysis, I'd be on the dialysis machine for five, six, seven hours at a time. So, but instead, we give kitty cats fluids, uh, and those fluids help to increase the flushing of the waste from his blood. You know, now, his blood work was horrible. The normal value for some of these kidneys is between 0.3 and 2.0. Curtis's numbers were 19.9, almost 20. But I remind people, we do not treat the numbers, we treat the patient. He was not acting as sick as his numbers indicate. So we've continued fluids here in the hospital on a daily basis, and he's now eating, he's now feeling better. Mommy's here, she's got a smile on her face. Now, she doesn't have a smile on her face, really, because she just got the bill. But she's got a smile on her face because... Uh, She's taking Curtis home. Mm -hmm. Christy, she doesn't have a smile on her face because she loves Curtis. Part of the reason <laughs> Curtis is doing so well is because of the fluids, but also Christy keeps mushing on him, mm -hmm. and Curtis is a love sponge. Yeah, he so, he likes so we're going to give him some more fluids here before he goes home. Dawn will be bringing him back a couple days a week, three days a week for a while, two days a week for a while. We'll repeat blood work and see how good... Curtis's kidneys. Now, compromised kidney function um, can be terminal, but uh, we give him the benefit of the doubt, especially because he's a five-year-old kitty cat. And a five-year-old cat, if we get his kidneys to function better, has some life expectancy. Had Curtis been 15 or 16, 17, we may not have gone to the lengths we did to attempt uh, but he's also had other medication, antibiotics, so, you know, drugs to stimulate his appetite and so forth. Because up here, like it says, top ten reasons uh, kitty cats visit the veterinarian. If you look there, number three is kidney disease. This is a big problem in kitty cats. But our boy Curtis here, thanks to Lisa, thanks to Mommy, thanks to Christy. Thanks to Doc. The team approach. The team approach, you know what the team approach is? Together, everyone achieves more. So it takes all of us to treat these cats.
We'll see how he does. Bye now.